hello. <coughs> hello, hello. Hi, Sam. No, you're not a coward. That was just to get all the people who are cowards. Of which you are not. So. Yes, we're continuing Fallout New Vegas today. Um, but before we get started, I have to go over the rules again. Because there are rules in this playthrough. And they are pretty much determined by the scores that I chose last time. My intelligence is one. One. My strength is nine. <laughs> and my charisma is like a seven or an eight. So, because I went with what a himbo has to be, which is they have to be stupid, they have to be beefy, but they have to be kind. If you don't have all those three things, they are not a himbo. In case you haven't seen, like, the triangle thing of what... If there are only two of those things, then they're this or this or that. Like a jock, a nice guy, or a, a, a beefcake. I don't remember what, the, what they are. are. But there, there's that tri triangle, right? Well, we have, to, we have to get to the middle of that triangle. Hunk, that's what it is. We have to get to the middle of that triangle in this game. So, I maxed out my strength and my charisma and min and minimized my intelligence. Cannot be intelligent. What that means <laughs> is that there are some things now in this game that I will never be able to do. I will never be able to repair anything. <laughs> I am surviving off of instinct alone because my survival is surprisingly very high. <laughs> uh, so I, I, I can't repair anything. I can't use vats because I will not be using uh, weaponry like guns or rifles or any, anything like that. Right now I am armed with a machete. So melee and thrown like explosives only. Uh, I will never be able to like pick any locks. <laughs> um and or any th or any knowledge checks that require you to have a high intelligence cuz I have a 1 in that regard. Um so I will just be whoosh, blowing my way through it. Um just on good vibes alone. So. So that's that's what we're we're doing. And uh, so last time we I didn't stream for very long, just enough to get the character started I do want to remind everyone of what I look ah fuck I can't show you what I look like anyway I have the uh shaved sides look going on here I got a little bit of some stubble um I'm blonde so okay that's not there we go uh and I had to go to Ringo. I'm h try helping Ringo out against. Oh. Hold right stick, then rotate left stick to see your face. No, no vats. Okay, uh, hold right stick, then rotate left stick. Is this not working? I'm 
I'm using an Xbox controller. I don't know if that were if that means anything. Anyway, uh, I look like a freaking moron, which is great. That is the ideal. It's the ideal. All right, so um, basically, sorry, I should check my. So my melee weapon skill, very high. It's at a 40. My speech skill and survival are very high, as is my aren't unarmed. My repair, science, and medicine, garbo. <laughs> um, Okay, so I have to return to Ringo and let him know that Sunny Smiles has agreed to help you fight the Powder Gangers. Okay. There it is. I need to go up to the, uh, tell Ringo that we're going to help him. I think this is going to be a fun run because when I played this game for the first time, I did what I always do which is guns, specifically sniper, sniping. Um, so what's going on? Did Sonny agree to help us? And this is actually easier. <laughs> Sonny's with us. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. Let's do this. All right, I'm ready. I hope. Time to look alive. The powder gangers are here to play. Sonny! Ellie's fish, Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. Let's go. I'll be set up near this door. Let's hope that the gang doesn't manage to make it that far. Time to defeat the powder gangers. We'll see how this goes. I'm gonna freaking kill them all. Howdy. Howdy. Come on. You met with the wrong bartender. Come on. Die, bitch. Uh, okay, so there's like one more. Never mind, he's dead. Oh my gosh! His leg! His leg fell off! Bottle caps. I'll take your dynamite. Oh my gosh, his head is gone! Well, I want the cowboy hat for sure. There's the other guy I killed. I literally decapitated him. Cleaver. Eh, I'll take it. Baseball bat. Heck yeah. Hey, Ringo. What is there more? Looks done to me. We can talk after this is over. Okay, so I thought it was over. I thought it was over. Did I miss something? Cause like, oh, okay, there's one more. <laughs> I am idolized. Idolized. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> I will 
I'll take all of your fa. Woohoo! Ain't nobody can hurt me. <laughs> okay, I killed Joe Cobb. Where? Everybody in here now? Who freaking left me? Yes, you look away for 30 seconds and I decapitated I someone. Favor for this. Here, these are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but I know they'll understand once I explain it. You're welcome. I'll stick around for a bit longer, but I'll be gone in a few days. If you ever visit New Vegas, look me up at the Crimson Caravan camp. I can't believe you suppressed the worker uprising. Uh, I was being on the uh, on on the on the right side of the law. That'll teach us how to gang to avoid good springs in the future. I need to get to Prim. Can you suggest a route? Sure can. Take the road southeast out of town till it hits the freeway. Prim is the town with the roller coaster straight south. Can't miss it. NCR patrols do a good job of keeping the highway clear, but I'd keep your gun where you can reach it easily. You never know who you'll run into. Off the road, you'll probably start running into hostile wildlife. My advice would be to stick to the highway when you can. Yes, ma'am. Goodbye. No, I'm not going through Casador Canyon. I'm not stupid. I know it. Well, I am stupid. I literally saved your ass. Probably I should sleep. Oh, it's a it's a bathroom. Oh, no rats. <laughs> You're like, holy man, you're stupid enough to do that? Every time I play this game, I go, I wonder if I can pull it off this time. The answer is always no. <laughs> Who needs sleep when you can just drink from the sink? Anyway, uh, <laughs> well, I'm not a, I'm not, I'm not a stealer or nothing. Um, let's see here. Um, probably I should check my weapons. So my, okay, 27. Or 17, anyway. have some throwing spears <laughs> we'll see which is better I really just oh look it's like a cell phone a Nokia survived all the way here they do not go with the gore here I was like whoo
probably I should pick a struggle. Um, travel to the canyon wreckage near Prim and enter the divide. That's the one, right? They went that away, right? Travel to the canyon. Hello. So I probably should like maybe if I slap a bandaid on the baseball bat it'll be better. Hi Omega. I forgot how to run. Bent. Tin Canyon. Spooky. Oh, Suave Gambler hat. Heck yeah. Uh. <laughs> Look at me now. <laughs> Before you venture deeper into the wasteland, you may revise your character. No. I am convinced. I am absolutely 100% committed. Music is creepy as fuck. Congrats on finding Indy. Like Indiana Jones? That's who... Wait, hang on a second. Was that a joke referencing Indiana Jones when he hides himself in the frickin' uh, refrigerator? <laughs> hey, are these uh, friends or no? You have discovered several locations. You can fast travel back to discovered locations using the world map in your pit boy. That is a great joke, actually. Hey! Hey! Jesus Christ. Hey, fuckers. Any lawman that comes after me won't have it easy. Read note. Not many patrols out here lately, which means not much loot. Our crew is thinking we should make a move soon. Follow the tracks up north, head towards the strip. You in? Ain't on the Chang Gang anymore, but we still gotta stick together. Hey, what's up? You eyeballing me? Not in a way that you like? Any lawman that comes after me won't have it easy. Sleeping. That's gonna heal my two busted legs. <laughs> right? Yep. We're all good. 
I slept, and now my legs are fine. Thanks for letting me use your bed. I bet. You take a sip from your trusty Vault 3rd Canteen. Trip on a landmine? Just take a nap. That's right. Hey! Hey, little fella! Oh, it, that's an enemy. He doesn't seem to bother. Ah! Oh, okay, we're over there. Eh, I'm sure they're fine. I don't think they're bothered. Oh my god. Isn't nature beautiful? Go on, come here. Come here. Come here. I'll eat you for fucking breakfast. Rad Roach. I don't know. I think I like my... Um, I think I like my machete more. Alright, so I've hot hot wired my uh or hot keyed my uh machete and the dynamite. I'm sure I won't need to do anything else. Only those. Um so Hey, who the hell do you think you're going to be? Prim is off limits. Hi. I can see what's going on in Prim. Oh, well, that What's sucks real bad. Shouldn't you be protecting the town or something? Who was it? They didn't fall under NCR jurisdiction. Even if they did, you're in no shape to protect them. Why can't you protect them? So, here's the dealio. I could just walk right in there and uh, just beat everyone to death. Um, which I think is a valid method. Um, I'm pretty sure there are landmines over there. Hey, hey Sergeant McGee. I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Nice Army. goggles. You want to talk about something, speak to Lieutenant Hayes. He looks like he's about to go on, uh, where are you from? I'm from Commissioned officer's office. 
Goodbye. Sir. Aw, oh, that's so nice. He called me sir. Hey, Lieutenant Hayes. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? What are you doing out here? We were sent out here to hold back the tide of convicts from correctional facilities. As you can probably tell, we aren't doing the kind of job we could be doing. What's the problem with your mission? The mission isn't the problem. The problem is the supplies. Convicts are better armed and organized than our intel initially suggested. I'm trying to get some reinforcements here, maybe some guns and some firepower, but things are just going slow. Do you have any information on the convicts? Not much. They've taken to calling themselves powder gangers, mostly because they've taken to using their explosives to make clear boulders with weapons. They got organized faster than I would have thought, most of them at least. Thankfully, the small group in town here seemed to have split off from the main force, so they aren't getting anything in the way of support. Tell me about the correctional facility. The mission isn't the problem. Ah! I already got this. Most people just call it NCRCF. That's NCR Correctional Facility. A little bit ago, the convicts there staged a coup. Killed the guards that weren't able to escape. And they've been ransacking the area since then. I have some other questions. Yes. Goodbye. <laughs> He wants a nuclear winner. All right. Well, shit. <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> Do I go into the town? Because I, I think there's, like, some landmines over there. Got business here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. I, I do. Um... Um <laughs> So the mat the lamb <laughs> Uh I see the one, two, three. This is the only way I can enter the town, right? Okay, we're throwing some spears. <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> And I have my... Okay, fine. Dynamite it is. Oops.
All right. Hello, Prim. How's it going? Just having a good old time. What? Serpentine, serpentine, serpentine. <laughs> Get fucked. Twenty dollars. Some bottle caps. More dynamite. Brick, yeah. Oh, I didn't want the pistol. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing it. I can't do that. Um, crispy squirrel bits. Why? No one can see me. Well, I'll be going in through the front door. <laughs> Fucking die. All right. The cosmic force of karma should leave me the fuck alone. Okay, um, medics, tire iron, looks awesome, I will not be picking that lock. I love how the first time I played this, Brendan was like, um, so you could go in through the front door. Or you could go in through the back. And I was like, okay, I'll go through the back. Uh, I'll have a better chance of, like, surprise that way. And now I'm like, Get fucked. These guys are freaking. Uh. Hey. Had <laughs> oh, this rules.
Come on. Come on. I'm saving. <laughs> Just in case. I think I already... Oh, I went through this way. A baseball? Had enough? All right, um, so that's done. Um, Someone was having a good bath there. Uh, <laughs> I can't even lock very easy doors. Is that all that's up here? Um, someone should really tell them that it's bad to burn books. Upstairs is mostly just, ooh, Nuka-Cola. Ooh, suitcase. Someone was having a good time. Pre-war money. Sure. Oh, this is the... Oh! Wait, Brendan, here's the back door. <laughs> I came in through that way before. Okay. Um... I do be looking for loot, though. I 
don't even have the skills to open a very easy locked door. It's the outdoors. I need to go downstairs again, I think. Killed everyone upstairs. It was easy peasy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I think this is it, right? Yes. This, I died so many times doing this the first time. <laughs> Holy fuck. I cleaved him, but good. Turbo. Oh, that's the drug, right? All right. Probably I should heal my limbs. Could also go to sleep, I guess. <laughs> Hi, Deputy Beagle. I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers that you can't be my rescue. Who are you? Oh, well, I'm Deputy Beagle, and I'm being held hostage. Can you imagine? I'd be most grateful if you would set me free. How'd you end up being a hostage? I must say it's been the low point of my career in law enforcement. The powder gangers stole into town at night and murdered my sister and her husband, the sheriff, in bed while I was sleeping in the office. I watched them for a bit, waiting for the right moment to pounce on the rest of the lot of them, taking careful notes as I watched. I am not executing him! <laughs> they found me while I waited in the shadows and brought me here. Uh, I'll set you free now. I think I'll be making my way outside now. The air is getting too close for me. If you try to run away instead of fighting on my side, I'll kill you myself. Oh, why, uh, of course. I'd never let you fight my kidnappers with my help. With, without it. You lead the way. Yeah, that's fucking right. Ordeal will be over soon. Beagle, take a weapon. I just hope I won't have to use it. You can have a cleaver. Eventually, we'll. 
Oh, a knife? I do love knives. Um, excuse me for a second. Just a second. There we go. <coughs> Thanks for waiting. Ooh, bottle caps. Free money. Woohoo. Anything good in here? Nope, come on, we're done. All right, uh, door to prim. Now where are we going? This way to the casino. I don't know what it was brought you to prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink. Hello, Johnson Nash. Who are you? Johnson Nash is my name. Husband of Ruben. We've been prim going on eight years now. Thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily. For what it's worth, with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express Outpost. I'm a courier with the Mojave Express. Well, I don't got any work right now, so I could do. I lost a package I was supposed to deliver. I'll tell you whatever I can. If you have a delivery order, you can show me. What can you tell me about this job? Oh, you're talking about one of them packages. That job had strange written all over it, but we couldn't turn down the press. What was strange about it? That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chest piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I had from the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's what you say, huh? He canceled? Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around. Asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain, we were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, let Courier 6 carry the package. That's what he said. It's like the Mojave sorts you out for change. Then he just up and walked out. Do you know who he was? Where he went? No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that. I guess I was scary. <laughs> I've been scary. <laughs> Maybe you thought your name was bad luck. Well, not for me to say. Some men stole my package. Man in a checkered suit and some thugs. They passed this way. Well, now that you mention it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for a supply. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. One of those men shot me. I need to know the best way to get to them. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Fagan. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them, and he was slinking around by some speed when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they was going. I'd like to ask you about something else. Well, Kill, I want to ask you more about the delivery I was supposed to make. Sure. Goodbye. Deputy Beagle. That was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Yes, I did. Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Breaking yourself out of... Of course. But it was quite 
I'd already killed everybody. Still no Lars, but what are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Yeah, uh, what are you talking about? You're the sheriff now. Oh no, I'm just a deputy, and I can't be a deputy without a sheriff. It's all a chain of command. What are the qualifications for a sheriff? It should be someone brave like you, but more of a homebody. Someone who'll settle down and watch over. I heard the powder gangers talking about someone in the prison named Myers who had some experience as a sheriff. He may be a good choice. Also, with the NCR so close by, you may be able to get them to take over the town. Not sure why they haven't helped out already. Beagle wants a new sheriff for Prim. He suggested an ex-sheriff at NCRF. I'll help bring law and order back you to will. Prim. Incarcerated up at NCRCF may be a good choice. You also may be able to convince that NCR guy across the road to take the town under his wing. Although martial law doesn't sound good. Hey there. Well, there's a bar. Prim resident, prim resident. They're just a bunch of unnamed prim. Just a bunch of unnamed people, really. Nobody I want to talk to. All right. These replica outfits show just how conscious Vicky was of the styles of the period. Cool. I don't see none of them, though. Prim, 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 prim. Where the fuck? Find Prim's lawman. Radio at the Prospector Saloon in Good Springs, blah, blah, blah. Are you winning, son? I think so. I feel like I'm winning. 
it has been extremely entertaining to just one shot pretty much everything. Hey, NCR, my dude. Hopefully they haven't, like, reset the bombs or anything. If they have, then my legs are fucked. Nope, we good. I look so cool. The way you can tell by the way I lose my walk, I'm a woman's man. No time to talk. See, forget, look at me. Woo! I look good. Prim is in dire need of some real law. We know Prim is great for Caesar's camp, and we aren't blind to the needs of the town, but we I took care of it. Powder gun. We don't have the guns or the personnel needed to carry out our mission, much less take on defending this town as well. What do you need to take over protecting the town? Well, we need more than anything is bodies. If we had just one more squad, we could easily install a sheriff and still handle our primary objective of protecting the interstate chapel here. If you'd like to see the NCR include protection of Prim and its duties, then you'll have to get some more troops up here. A night at Mojave Outpost may be able to help. Have you gotten a... Not yet, but I will Roger. soon. I will. It's 12 a.m. Let's sleep for a little bit. I'm gonna... Gonna do a good thing. So glad I don't have the bomb that causes a nuclear winter to happen whenever somebody says that. Where's this fucking prison? I think it's down the other way from Good Springs. <laughs> Lots of soda bottles. You would think that they would like me more and they'd be like, yes, please take all of our stuff. Mojave Outpost. I need to go the other way for My game crashed. Never change, Bethesda. Oh, I just exited his tent. Okay, so. I didn't lose shit.
You missed the crash. Uh, you didn't miss shit. It just went to black. <laughs> My game crashed. <laughs> uh, super classic. So far, uh, my being stupid has only meant that I can't unlock doors and I can't re. <laughs> well, I can't fix things. Okay. Um... I want to place a marker. So I just need, really just need to keep going straight. Got it. Oh, I remember this place. I died like 50 times. There's guys over there, like powder gangers. You better get out of here. You better get out of here. Aha! Where the fuck are they? Oh, behind me. Oh, I got, uh... Come on. Fucking die, bitch. Jackal gang leader. Interesting. I thought that there was another guy that I killed, but... I died so many freaking times the first time I came this way. Well, uh, so do you think that we're welcome here?
There's a lot of bugs in there. I think... I think there's a lot of bugs in there. bench <laughs> so cool nothing I can do there oh my god easy peasy Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Um. Okay, so I. Is it in there or something? Must be. Yeah, it must be in there, but I can't because I can't. Uh. Lo unlock pick. I I can't pick locks. All right. Back on the road. Well, that sure was something. Burbies! I think, um, do you think he's okay? Um, well, he did now. Well, that was easy. Barely an inconvenience. The center cannot hold. Whatever the fuck that means. I don't know. I can't read. Hey, Brahmin. Hey there, traveling merchant. Need anything? Yes, sir. Sure. Here's what I got.
Healing powder. A stealth boy. Sturdy caravan shotgun. You can have that. You can have that. See if you even have anything that I want. Mini nuke. Thanks. Cow! Howdy. Howdy. How to howdy. All right. So I know there's fucking shit in there. I'm about to get jump scared up here. I like to think I'm too stupid to get jump scared. Oh, I discovered the Mojave outpost. Hi, Sergeant Kilborn. Must be crazy to brave those roads. Yup. What is this place? Outpost. Mojave outpost. Watching a lot of nothing feels like a big Brahmin camp or caravan. They've been stopped for a while, waiting for the roads more to clear. Or the clearance papers to disappear. Looks like you've walked away, so if you need to shake the dust off, head through the barracks at the bars there. Not much, but better than nothing. Any work around here? I know of. But if you've come from the north, means you can travel freer than most around here. Might check the barracks. Someone might need you to hook it somewhere. Just be careful when you go up on the roof. Got a sniper watch on the road. If your gear's in need of repair, HQ's also worth checking out. Talk to Major Knight, he can help. Provided you got a pen and plenty of ink. I'll be going now. Thank you very much. Out, everyone. Hello. Hello. Sure is nice to meet y'all. Hi, Major Knight. Caravan, citizen, pilgrim, or a uh, courier. Just need something for the log book. Tabs on traffic throughout the outpost. I think they just in, not out yet. If you're looking for the commanding officer, he's in the back. Although, he's got a lot on his plate, so if you speak with him, keep it short. Also, if you need any gear tech, we can get you up and running again. Once you fill out the work orders and sign for the parts. I need repairs. <laughs> I'd like to talk to you about Prim. Prim. These units are stationed up there. They're having problems with some of the NCRCF convicts. What can I help you with? Hayes is under man and is requesting some additional support. I'd like to help. We can't spare any more units. We have to maintain a minimum headcount at the outpost. Orders from the West. 
having Prim and the trade route under NCR control would help the West. I'm good at talking. Who are you? May I speak to Hayes about NCR protection for Prim. Um, goodbye. Sir. They're so nice calling me sir and what? Ranger Jackson. Looks like we got a new visitor in the old Brahmin's hut. Too many people coming here in a hurry. They ain't passing through. Man, if you're passing through, you picked a bad time. Is this I Liam O'Brien? If I let a caravan through, they won't make it. You sure seem like you have enough soldiers. Soldiers, no. Cruisers, yes. And the Mojave Outpost has been ordered to have a standing force at the NCR perimeter at all times. Hang on, I have to look this up. Now reduces the outpost's numbers and would be in direct violation of my orders to back away. Anyway, I can help. Help? No, look, I appreciate that. But you know what? Yes, I could use a help. But you look like you can handle yourself. I need to get the caravans moving again. That means clearing a path north. There's too much crawling the ass. It is Leo O'Brien. <laughs> That's a voice I'd recognize anywhere. Sounds like a deal. Thanks. I appreciate it. Come back here when you're done. I might accidentally leave some supplies for you. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. <laughs> when I think, oh, I'm just a simple country career. <laughs> I like to. I need to remember what my name is. Um, clear out the critters on the road to Ivan Paw Lake. Hello. Hello. Okay, so I gotta clear out some critters. And uh, I sure ho hope that there's nothing scary about them. Nobody likes critters. That sure looks like a lot of critters. <laughs> I don't like that at all. <laughs> That's a disgusting amount of quest markers. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, grow. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, no. giant bugs in this game. I know that. Oh, but they're so big. Okay, I thought there was one more. there. Oh, right there. Thank you for waiting. Oh, my God. Okay.
Okay. Like, when the these ones are, like, not too bad. But when I saw the freaking giant one come up on me the first time... Oh, holy moly. <laughs> now, I do say that is a terrifying giant soldier ant. Oh, I don't like that at all. <laughs> oh, I could ride him, though. It'd be easy. <laughs> so the thing is, then I could uh, just ride one of them ants down the way here. Oh my gosh, I sent his legs all over the place. Listen, sir, please, please don't tell anyone. <laughs> Oh, I wonder what's over there. Excuse me. Wait till... I'm sorry, the what? There are fire ants? <laughs> A rat scorpion queen? Listen, I've killed some scorpions in my day. <laughs> But, dear God, does it not make a man want to just curl up somewhere and not look outside. <laughs> Rad Scorpion Queen? Okay. Huh? It's bigger than you. There's a scorpion bigger than me? Why don't you do me a huge favor and tell me where it is so I can just never go there? Because I would like to never go there. Cool. Good for the Legion. Um it's been a long trip. All I can think about now is going to Hollow. Liam O'Brien, where are you? There you are. Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you. Nothing else on the radar at the moment. You mentioned a reward before? No, I mentioned you might accidentally get supplies. Level up. Not a lot to contract mercenaries to the outskirts. Thank you, Liam. All, uh, requisition forms didn't get lost, and they're not gonna come check. Welcome to level four. I have 11 skill points. I think I'll do that for now. Ooh, I get to choose a perk. Um... In combat, you do 75% critical damage against animals and mutated animals. That'd be pretty good. Intense training perk. You can put a single point into any of your special attributes. They sometimes have access. Should I be a gay himbo? Do I want to go for the flavor, or do I <laughs> want the... I assumed you were a gay... Listen, Ben, because I know it's you. Yes, I'm a gay himbo. <laughs> that is ass assumed. But do we want to make it part of the game, is what I'm asking. Um, so I can do... Confirmed Bachelor or Hunter... Intense training also could be good. I think I've picked that one before, though. Because I put... I could bring myself up to 10 strength. Let's do that. Look at my stat layout. 10, 5, 6, 8, 1, 6, 6. I don't need
need a service rifle. I don't need anything. I don't use any of this. Okay. Um, can someone please? I. Hello. Hi, Liam. <sighs> so it, it's true that I am a gay himbo. Um. Oh, here's the barracks. Hi, Lacey. New face in the alcove. Must have come from the north. So, what do you have? Uh, I was hoping. What do you have for trade? Take a um. Nothing I want. You can have. This and can I shoot grenades? I don't know. I'm not going to be using this. You can have that. I don't need this. You can have that. I am not aiming to... Anything good? around here. Ooh, baseball bat. Cork core increases attack speed. Heck yeah. Brass knuckles. Okay. Never mind. Bye, man. I'll be going now. <laughs> Hi, Cass. Looking for trouble? Yes, ma'am. Just minding my business. Busy, huh? Now there's a sore loose tendon. You run along now. Judging by that busted pilot light expression you fixed with, Disney ain't so good. Are you all right? All right? No, I'm not all right. Drinking to forget, and it's only getting me mad instead. Whiskey always gets my temper up now more than ever. Drinking used to cause all sorts of trouble. It's chaos. Before I punched enough people, that is. And they learned to lay low when the whiskey hit. What are you trying to forget? I lost my caravan heading north. The driver burned to ash. And they didn't even take the cargo. They just burned that too. Why would they do that? My guess is Legion. They're trying to cut NTR supply lines. And the Mojave outpost is free. Got us locked up tighter than a New Vegas region. No caravans in, out, and just try arguing with Jackson about it. Roads aren't safe, he says. No shit, you wash that old fuck up. I didn't need a Brotherhood scribe to tell me that. A ma'am. Not some person nation. Yeah, he's been with NCR so long, all he can see is the worst outcome of everything. It is your wife, but Sam. He doesn't do anything. Jackson won't let me head north. It's not safe. And even though my caravan's gone, my caravan papers are keeping me here. So if you came here for work, my advice? Go find the Crimson Caravan Branch south of Vegas. They can help you out. Already cleared the roads for Jackson. No shit. Drinks on me then. Still, not like I'm going anywhere. Caravan title's still keeping me here even though it's dead and gone. I wanted to ask you something else. What's on your mind? Why are you here at the bar? Whiskey and me are old friends. Keeps me going when times get rough. Like now. Got me into the caravan business, you know. Had to start transporting water instead of liquor, though. If I hadn't switched over, 
I'd end my trip with nothing but glass bottles rattling on the back of a Brahmin. Never mind, I'll be going. You take care now. I think people just like me. Um, 12, that's 3, 4, 5, 6. 15 hours of sleep. Woohoo! Getting the best. Then we'll go do our whatever. Hey. Hey. Hey, when, uh... When can I get me like a cool thing like that? Though I'm the coolest dressed around. I know there's a sniper up here. A real hottie, so I've heard. your footsteps down at the ramp. Didn't sound like a trooper or one of the merchants. You a courier? If so, this might be your lucky day. If you don't mind walking a bit, and your eyes are good. You a courier? If so, this might be your lucky day. Depends on the work. I think there's trouble in Mitchell. No traffic from there on the road. And while I can explain that away, most in the town I can't. I'm sure it's been hit, but I need some news if they survived it. Might be powder games with all that smoke in the air. If there's anybody left, they'd be in the Nixon Town Hall. Go there. Check it out. Let me know what you find. I'll do it. Right. Look at you. All fired up and ready to go. Wish the others around here had that kind of attitude. Listen, I don't want you getting killed for this. So if you head there and run into trouble, I'm asking for eyes and ears, not your life. All right? Mind yourself on the flank going down. Yes, ma'am. All right. Uh, speak to Hayes about NCR protection. Okay, I need to speak to Hayes. So much walking! So much walking! I bet my freaking calves are next level. Hello, hello. I freaking love your mustache, sir. I've got heartache by the number. Something, something, something. Hmm, what's this place over here? Huh! There sure are... Get fucked. Well. Uh, I think they're done. I think that was it. And. Ooh. Cram. 
yeast, gumdrops, bottle cap. Note added, guess whose luck keeps rolling? Don't know. Not yours, I'm guessing. Where's New Canaan anyway? Wait. Honey Mesquite Pod. Sounds delicious. Well, didn't get anything good there. Just a couple of rad scorpions. We do be running down the road. I look awesome. He's just going on a, a, a fun, fun little jog. What does this say? Holster your weapon at Gomorrah. Interesting. <sighs> Can you run any faster? Wait. Good old sunglass clipping lady. Yeah, it was clipping through her face, huh? I should probably download more mods to make this game more stable. Hey, hey. Yeah. Uh, I got extra troop support for Prim. Wait, what are you running now? What do you mean? Yeah, I just got word of that. There's a squad of rangers standing by. Sergeant McGee will take over as sheriff, and the rangers will be his deputies. This town will be in NCR territory. What do you What do you mean? What are you running now? Inspection. The citizens will also need to become registered NCR More mods. And pay any appropriate associated taxes. Yes. Uh, I just have some cosmetic mods for, well, uh, I'd have to look at Nexus again, or Vortex, but some, like, basically some cosmetic mods and some bug fixing mods. Roger. I'll radio them over now. Uh, that's all, I think. Do I have to find... Okay, so I did all of that.
fucking crashed again. <laughs> there has to be, like, some kind of... Anyway, I'll, uh... I'm running three. New Vegas script extender and the texture and a textures mod. That's it. I'm sure there's more. I if anyone has recommendations for like either cosmetic mods or mods to make the game run more smoothly. Uh, that would be highly appreciated. Yeah, this just keeps crash. This is the second time it's crashed on me in the past two hours. And I don't know if it's like. Script extender or. I don't know. It's literally three, it's two mods. It's two mods. So really, I just need, like, if there's any that are good for stability, then that would be helpful. Be really nice. Um, also, I'm going to we're gonna take a quick break. Like, say, ten minutes or so. Probably not even that. Um, get a snacky snack. Make sure that you're drinking water. Follow me if you're not already. Um, and I, cause, um, uh, yeah, I want a snack, so. I'll be right back. Peace.
Okay, we're back. Hope y'all got your snacky snacks and your water and whatever it else else it is you need to enjoy yourselves. Let's get this going again. All right. We will make it work. <laughs> it would help me supremely if you would spread my going live notifications and stuff. Especially because I'm funny. That's what we want. So yeah, mods, uh, definitely a thing I need to do a little bit more research on, because I haven't obviously played or modded this game as much as I have Skyrim. But also, like, I played this game vanilla on Xbox. And it was fine. Like, it never crashed. So, I'm wondering if I did something wrong with installing. I don't know. A missile?! I'll take it. Okay, so he's like in here, right? Oh my god! Oh my god, what is happening? It's so... Ah! Oh my god, what is happening? Jesus. Well, if it isn't the lawbreaker. That's me. Can you tell me about the man in the checkered suit who came through here? Ah, uh, yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my bondage. I was caught uh, performing recon, gathering information on some of the powder gangs, when some great cons arrived with your friend in the suit. They were talking about some delivery they took from a courier. I assume that was you. They said they'd be heading through Nipton to Novak for me to contact them. Head to Novak through Nipton. Ask around Novak about your attackers. Okay. Um, good, because I also need just to get to the Nipton Town Hall. Because I believe it's this way. It's this way. Yeah. 
You know, in my opinion, there's not much creepier than an abandoned freaking play structure. Don't fucking come over here. I'll kill you. Probably I should go back on the road. You paid for what you did to the powder, didn't you? Ah! Oh my god, the fucking frame rate. Holy fuck. This is so awful. What the fuck is happening? I am running the New Vegas script extender and a like this cosmetic mod. I don't know. It was the highly rated one on uh And I don't know, maybe this is just like a problem on PC. I mean, for all I know, it could be. I don't. Because I didn't have any problems with this on the Xbox. Like, when we were playing it on Xbox, it was fine. I'm guessing that these are enemies. So we're going to go the other way. Okay, this is Nipton. I just have to find the way in. I love how they're all like, stay on the fucking road. And I'm like, yeah, no. I will not be doing that.
What? Are you feeling all right? Are you kidding me? You never felt better. Yeah. What sort of lottery did you win? What lottery? The lottery. That's what a lottery. You stupid. Yeah. Are you a powder ganger? Powder ganger? What? I mean, yeah, I used to be, sure. But not no more. Powder gang is small time, man. I'm a winner. I won the motherfucking lottery. <laughs> See you later. Bye. Bye. Well, I would say this is. Are you fucking kidding me? First, I get my leg smashed, and then in walks the powder ganger's grim fucking reaper. What the fuck have you got against us, man? Jesus fucking Christ. If you want me dead, just give me 15 medics and I'll fucking OD for you, okay? Fuck. What happened to this town? Why are you still here? I don't know. I just love it here. What the fuck do you think, asshole? He's not very happy with me. I don't think it's necessary to be this rude. I'm fucking crippled, get it? I could sp I'd spare some medics. Fucking dream come true, ain't you? How much you gonna give me? One dose. Fucking deal. Hand it over, asshole. How did you survive? Tell me about the lottery. It ain't like we came to Nippon to play it. Me and my crew had it worked out to kidnap some ECR people to come to town to get laid. Had it all worked out with the scumbag Ned. We were gonna ransom them off, keep their weapons for ourselves, a nice deal. How'd your plan go wrong? We get in position, next thing we know, we're surrounded by those fucking Legion fans. They dragged us and everybody else into the center of town. And that asshole with a dog on his head, he starts talking about how we're bad people. He said we needed to be punished for what we did. Not all of us, but some of us. And then he gives everyone a fucking lottery ticket. What happened after everyone got lottery tickets? What do you think? We started drawing tickets and that's how people got punished. First up was the lucky losers. They got decapitated. Guess that's lucky peasants to the quick. Then came the crucifixes. God damn, but those went on and on and on. Third place runners up got enslaved. I got the fuck beat out of my legs and the winner, they let go free. What happened to the mayor? Him? When his ticket came up, they burned him alive on a pile of tires. Well, that's not very good. You said some of the people were enslaved. Yeah, a bunch of those Legion fucks dragged him off right away. They were headed east, but they're feeling heroic. I'll do what I can to save them. Let's talk about something else. I need to get going. Well, this is just bad news bears. I I would say like the rest of these degenerates. It's useful that you have in mind. I want you to witness the fate of the town of Nipton, to memorize every detail. And then, when you move on, I want you to teach everyone you meet the lesson that Kaisar's Legion taught you, especially the Nuancial troops you run across. Asking me to remember anything might be a bit of a 
big task. <laughs> what lessons did you teach here? Often serves as the perfect object lesson. What exactly happened here? Nixon was a wicked king. Today he's become corrupt. He served all comers as long as they paid. He offered the cheap powder day those men of the Legion, such as myself. He really didn't care. It was a town of whores. For a pittance, the town agreed to leave those it had sheltered into a trap. Only when I came did they realize they had caught inside its snare. You captured everyone? Yes. When I handed them to the center of town, I told them their secrets. The foremost came out to blood. I told them they were legionaries or disloyal. Some are punished. The others made to watch. And I announced the lottery. Each clutched his ticket, hoping it would set him free. Each did nothing. Even when loved ones were dragged away to be killed. You sl slaughtered innocent civilians? Ha! Innocent. Hardly. I think y'all are very mean. Yet not once did they try to resist. Probably because you have guns. And watched as their fellows were butchered, crucified, and burned. One by one, they stood and hoped their turn would not come. Your crimes are unforgivable. Crimes, if you feel strongly about it, attack us, and soon you won't feel a thing. Really? Nothing? I fucking blew them up and they were like, yeah, no big deal. Bye. <laughs> For your overwhelmingly monstrous behavior, you have become vilified by the community. Um, I'll take that. A ripper? What do you mean, uh-oh? What's uh-oh? What's uh-oh? What do you mean, uh-oh? Brendan, what do you mean, uh-oh? Brendan? Brendan, answer me.
Kaiser can fuck off. Good luck with the assassins? Eh. I'm sure there won't be any problems. Whatsoever. No, no, no. <laughs> I just wanted to see how easy they were to kill, okay? Kind of drunk off power right now. Should I reset my save? <laughs> Is it that bad what I just did? I feel like I did a good thing. I don't like Kaiser's Legion. <laughs> also, uh... Nah, I'm sure it's fine. Okay, where did I have to go? Oh, I need to go back to Mojave. Plus an endless supply of free machetes. Thank you, Sam, for always seeing the, the, the good side. Going to be passing through Legion territory soon, but I'm sure the NCR can totally protect you. Check out the Nipton Town Hall yet? Smoke Trail's not getting any shorter. Nipton was attacked by the Legion. Legion this far west? You're fucking kidding me. That's not outside the border. They're moving in. And fast. Nipton wasn't the most friendly town, but... <sighs> All right. Thanks for checking on that. I should set my mind at ease. Now I'm more on edge than ever. Did you have friends there? In Nipton? Hell no. Town was a shithole, asking to be burned. Just not by Legion. Nobody deserves that. Well, thanks for hoofing it there and back, even if it was bad news. Wish we could spare the troops to go hunting, but orders are to stay put. Fucking Mojave's going to hell, and all I can do is sit here and watch. Level up! Level up! Ten skill points. Uh, ain't not 30... Hmm. 
All right. And I'm. It, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So I need to go rescue some captives. 